ni hao. In today's lesson, I'm going to share with you how to make a yes no question with an adjective, which means that how do you use Mandarin to say how are you? Or are you tired? Are you busy? Those sentences in Mandarin. Okay, now here we go. So if you want to ask a person how are you? Well, you say ni hao ma. Ni hao ma. Ni is you. Hao is good. Ma is a yes no question word. All right. So you have to remember na ma is not just a question word. It is a yes no question word. So ni hao ma literally means you good yes or no. So here we have a structure. You use subject. An adjective, and the yes/no question word. Now you have a yes/no question with an adjective. Ni lei ma. Ni lei ma. So you just simply replace the different adjectives, and you could have many different yes/no questions. Okay. So ni lei ma. You tired? Yes or no? And then, if you want to say, "Um, you happy or not?" You say, "Ni kuai le ma." Ni kuai le ma. So now you're asking people, "Are you happy? You happy? Yes or no?" All right. And then one more, if you want to ask a person, "Are you busy?" Ni mang ma. Ni mang ma. Mang is busy. So. Ni mang ma? You busy? Yes or no? All right. This is the first structure to make a yes/no question、uh, with an adjective. And there's another structure. Previously, we learned a sentence、uh, ni hao ma, which is、uh, you good or not good, right? And now I'm going to give you another sentence structure. Also means how are you? Which is ni. 好不好？你好不好 ？Take a closer look at the sentence. I was literally saying, "You good? Not good." 你好不好 ？You good? Not good. So this is also means how are you? But I'm using a different sentence structure instead of 你好吗 ？So here comes the point. You can use either ni hao ma structure or ni hao bu hao structure. They're both commonly used in our Mandarin speaking world. But if you use the structure ni hao bu hao, there's no ma in the end. You don't say ni hao bu hao ma. No, because hao bu hao already asking you good or not good, yes or no. All right. Let's try another sentence. If I want to say you busy with the structure, the new structure, I would say, 你忙不忙？你忙不忙 ？Okay, my hand is doing the tone gesture. Okay, 你忙不忙 ？So you busy or not busy? All right. And the next one, if I want to say, are you happy or not with the structure? I would say. I want to let you try first. Okay, so 你快乐不快乐？你快乐不快乐 ？But this is kind of too long, so we are going to shorten it a little bit. 你快不快乐？你快不快乐 ？So it means you happy or not? So、uh, I omit one word. Le, which you can see on the screen. So, 你快不快乐 You happy or not happy? The last one, if I want to ask you, are you tired or not with the structure? I will say, 你累不累？你累不累 All right, that's all for today. So now you know there are two sentence structures to say 
yes or no questions with an adjective and they're both commonly used in Mandarin speaking world so you can use either one and they're exactly the same so that's all for today uh, I hope you understand if you have any question please leave a comment below until then I'll see you next time 加油再见